Hey there, Dean Bracco here with uh, Blabbit Canada. Thought I'd give you a quick little tour of our new Innisfil Connects timeline and uh, the changes that Facebook's made, maybe uh, some of these things that you know already or, or you want to learn a little bit more about how to navigate through Facebook as well as the Innisfil Connects page here. Timeline is a change that Facebook's made to you know help enhance the user experience and uh, see a little bit more of the history or story of a business or in our case our town Facebook page. This top part here is called the uh, cover photo and uh, this was designed by Janet Tonello of Lakeside Graphics. She designed this as well as our new Innisfil Connects logo and she did a wonderful job and thank you again Janet for doing that for us. Uh, it's beautiful. With the timeline, the, Facebook's made a lot of changes to make it easier to see what your friends are doing on um, other pages, uh, seeing what other information is going on. If you look up top here, you can change your view of timeline by looking at your friend activity, post by page only. Post the, the, you're only going to see my post there. What I encourage you to do is click on this other post by others once in a while when you're on the page and see what other people are talking about on Innisfil Connects and uh, they might be promoting businesses, organizations, charity events, whatever's happening or just general comments about what's going on around town. So if you take a look and you're scrolling through and you're reading information here, you're clicking on see more, you know, go ahead and, and click on the like button if you like somebody's comment or, you, or you've read their comment, that sort of thing. It's a different way of connecting and letting people know that... Uh, you're reading their information and interacting with them. I know there's a lot of people I talk to out in the community when I'm out at Taki or different events, and uh, they're reading the information, but if you're not clicking on the like or, or connecting, you're not going to get all the information from the town page as well as what else is going on. So you see a picture like this, and uh, you know you might want to leave a little comment about the snow in spring. You know, whatever it is, go ahead and feel free to leave a comment, let them know that you appreciate them sharing their information. So anytime you're right through here, the drop down will show you the different views that you can have. The other drop down that we have here, and it's also along the side here, it's always showing, is the timeline. So what we're trying to do here with Innisfil Connects, and there's uh, some people that are helping out with this, but the whole town or all our fans here could get involved. We're trying to build out the history of Innisfil right on Facebook. So started right back in 1615 when uh, Samuel de Champlain was the first European to see Ennisville and uh, we're building it out over time as we get new information and, and uh, new pictures that sort of thing but you can click on each of the dates and scroll down and see our history you know great opportunity for us to learn a little bit more about our community it's a little slow here when I've got uh, the recording going on but uh, you can go ahead and play with that on your own time if you, if you take a look at um, the timeline drop down here, it'll show you a lot of the custom apps that we do. And these custom apps are also right at the top here. They're featured, uh, these are all links to another section of the Innisfil Connect site. This app here, for example, Contest, is quite popular. We try and run a weekly contest uh, promoting local businesses and just letting you know who else is on Facebook if you're... Um, Learning, uh, if you're learning a little bit more about Allendale Golf Course, you can go ahead and click on the link. It'll pull up in their Facebook page. If uh, you want to just support them a little bit, give them a like. You can give them a good uh, reference if you've been there. Entering the contest is quite simple. You just enter your email address and uh, contact information. Check off your boxes and hit subscribe. And you only need to enter the contest once, and you'll be entered into all our Innisfil Connects draws. You don't have to enter again. Once you do enter, uh, you can click the share button and uh, let your friends know that there's a contest going on. There's a contest happening. I'm not the best typer in the world, but uh, if you bear with me, we'll get it done. And then you hit share photo. Now, if you're looking to share, you can share it on your own wall, which go to your news feed. You can share it on a friend's wall. Um, I'm just going to share it on my own wall and post it out. And anybody that's interested will be able to click that link. And if you go over to my, uh, my news feed, it'll pull up here. I'm just using a fake account here so I can do more of a demonstration on Innisfil Connects without all the admin information getting in the way. 
We've got uh, the news tab uh, is another one that uh, we see a lot of hits to. And this is just a, a photo slideshow that um, people can contribute to by just clicking here. You can add your own photos to the slideshow. And there's uh, Colleen does a lot of photos and, and uploads them there as well as to the wall. We've got the NSFL scope um, live feed in here so you can go through and, and catch up on articles. Uh, the TSN score checker, and you can find out what's happening in the CFL or, you know, NHL, whatever games are happening. So a little bit of information, all just making it easy for you to view it right through Facebook. We'll jump back to our page again, and uh, let's scroll down. There's the contest uh, that we saw from the tab. You see people are sharing this. This is how we're promoting the contest, clicking like on the contest. Giving value back to our sponsors is important, as well as that's a uh, chance for everybody to win. There's free entry into all this, so it's pretty cool. If you're looking at uh, pictures, if you click on the picture, you'll get a larger view of it, and uh, you can click right through and see all the pictures, leave a comment, leave a like, whatever it is. Uh, I love this picture here that came up with our dirt storm. Different information. You see something happening on the 400. A lot of us are commuters, and uh, you post that information right to Innisfil Connects, and you might uh, help somebody else out. They'll take a different route home. So uh, those are the, the main changes that have happened with Timeline. Again, the top part, and then the scrolling down here. And then the other area that's uh, really cool, that's it's new with Facebook. And if Innisfil's connecting through Facebook, we're all going to be able to share and promote and find out what's happening in our community. If you click here on this link here, and um, there's usually a button here. I already subscribed to this list. But what it is is it's a custom news feed that you'll see on the left-hand side here, updates from Innisfil Businesses. And all the businesses, whether it's the journal, um, our company there, you see Blabbit Canada. We build a lot of custom Facebook pages. Thanks for the plug. I thought I'd get that in there. But, you know, whether it's dancing or uh, cafes and specials, the Chicken Cordon Bleu here, Spring Tree Farm. Oh, they're sensing an upcoming contest. I wonder uh, if they're the next uh, giveaway people. So that gives you an idea of what's happening in your community. With your regular news feed, you're getting all the information from all your friends, all the different um, businesses that, that you've liked over the years. This will give you a real localized view of Facebook and, and who's involved with Facebook. So I hope you enjoy. If you do um, get a chance to, uh, to go back to our page, feel free to copy this link here and share it or share any photos. Let your friends know that Innisfil is, is here. And this is a great way for us to promote uh, our town to the rest of, um, of Ontario and Canada, really. So more of us uh, that are getting involved in showcasing Innisfil, we're all doing this and saving the, you know, the marketing dollars and all these advertisements that we're looking to spend money to promote our town. This is a great way to do it just with a share or a like or leaving a comment. So... Hope you enjoy the page. Again, uh, if you have anything to say, leave a comment. Uh, let us know what you think. This here is open up to anybody. Upload a photo. You know, leave your post. All sorts of things you can do. Hope you enjoy it, and uh, we'll talk to you on, on the new timeline, formerly called The Wall. Take care.